Hi, this is Debbie from Video Home and Garden at YouTube.com. I'm going to show you how to flute the edges of a pie crust, properly vent and decorate the top of the crust. After you have placed the top crust onto the pie, carefully trim away just a little bit of the edges, leaving a nice clean straight edge to the crust. Gently fold the top crust under the bottom crust and do that all the way around. Just kind of press it down like that. Do it gently so you don't tear the crust. Now to flute the edges of the crust, just take your thumb of your right hand and your index finger of your right hand and we're going to kind of press and pinch the crust like this as we're pressing it down. Also take the index finger of your left hand and push against the side of the crust while we're doing that. So it's just like that. Press and push. Press, push and pinch. Press, push and pinch. Very easily done. It does take a little practice, however. And then just go all the way around your pie and press and pinch. Kind of keep it out towards the edge of the pie tin. Press and pinch, press and pinch, till you get all the way around the pie. Try to make those kind of uniform. Takes a little practice. Okay, we're all done with that. Now, to vent the pie, we're going to take a sharp kitchen knife with a point, and then right in the center, poke that point right in there and make a nice little slit. You do it carefully. And then just place a couple more around the pie, kind of center them so they look kind of nice. Decorative. Put one over there and one over there. And then to decorate the pie, this is a cherry pie. So I just cut out little circles and stems out of the leftover pie crust. Just to kind of roll the little stem so it looks like a stem instead of just a cut piece of crust. And then just carefully place it onto the pie like so just like that and then just sprinkle a little granulated sugar on the top of your pie and then it's ready to, put, to bake and bake it, the pie according to the pie fillings instructions or in, according to your pie's instructions whichever that is and then you have a really good pie and a little decoration that adds a lot of pizzazz to the pie. It really looks great and it tastes great too. Please watch my other YouTube videos, how to make flaky pie crust from scratch the easy way, how to easily place a pie crust into a pie pan, filling the pie and placing the top crust. To automatically receive my free how-to videos, please click on the subscribe button below. Thank you for watching.